speaking of tea, do you have any? Bitch. <laughs> so it's like the trash literally took itself out. Yeah, gone. Like goodbye. We see the changes in each other. Like I see, obviously your ass getting fatter. Like you know, like your abs. Like Sony's getting married to you guys. I know. I got a proposal. Forgot to vlog it though. Did you vlog it? No. Guys. Ooh. <laughs> Hey everyone, it is Sonia Elsie here. Today I'm here with the Stelgio Rejo. Thank you. <laughs> um, but today we yeah. have a very exciting mukbang for you guys. So we are at this restaurant called Walk and Roll. It is in Long Beach and they recently added a ton of vegan options to their menu. So they were kind enough to invite us over and let us feast. So, um, yeah, are you excited? Oh my God, I'm so excited, <laughs> you guys. So you have garlic chicken, dumplings, I have beef and broccoli, ramen, and then we also have some chow mein and some fried rice and also some cake stuff here. So we're filming this in the actual restaurant, so you guys are gonna be hearing like restaurant sounds everywhere but i really wanted to give this kind of a nikocado avocado vibe and really just film it in the restaurant Got so yeah ladies how is it mm. oh my god dude this is so good really mm -hmm. i really want to try that mm. we'll switch off this is a beef <laughs> remember when like probably like a 2015, our sense of humor was only beef. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. A chicken? Oh my god, I want to try that. Chicken! Dude, oh my god. That's so good. You were really like this. Let me dig into the tea. Speaking of tea, do you have any? Bitch. <laughs> no, we have many. We have many. Can we talk about how you're like being sober this month? Oh my god, yeah. Which I feel like it's not really that extreme. People are like shook that I drink mm -hmm. or do anything. Yeah. Like, what just... happened to you? <laughs> it's like, I well, I mean, you did. Especially for you, you started YouTube like when I was very young, nine years old. So people have seen you since you were really young. For me, I started like kind of when I started. Like I feel like my personality is mostly the same. Mm-hmm. That's really true. Mm -hmm. But for you, you've like really grown really a lot. Also, y'all, we're wearing um, Health as Well from StellaSoja.com. If you didn't know, we have clothing line together. This is gonna be available for October only, and. Uh, yeah, check it out. It'll be available by the time you guys see this video. Mm. I think this is my favorite. Even though I've only tried these two. We should try the four guests. Yeah. Mm. 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 Kind of has like a slight ginger vibe. I love ginger <laughs> Ladies, ladies. This is bomb. Dude, right? No. Like, I'm so hungry right now. Like, all day. I've been thinking about this. It's kind of got me through the week, honestly, because it is yeah. Friday. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ladies. Let's try um this. This is like... Ooh. This is not how the flavor I was expecting. It's like, it's like sauce. Tofu vibe? Oh. It's almost like an egg vibe, but obviously not egg. Mm. So what are your, what are your plans for this one? Um, just to really focus on the gym and YouTube and my podcast and like all of that. Just kind of like yeah, because it's past few months, like it's been summer, I've been kind of like, hit. No, right? <laughs> Just kind of focusing, getting slumped in. <laughs> All of the above. I 
think I want to I want to focus on my my acting career, I guess, because I've really been doing a lot recently. Seriously, it's been like fun. Um, like I've had to actually be that bitch that's like, sorry, I have an audition. Like, never Seriously. used to be that bitch. It's exciting. Thank you. I'm just like, I don't know, because sometimes I'll really get down on myself and I'll be like, oh my gosh, I'm doing nothing. But then I'm like, dude, I'm 20 and I have a lot of life to live. I need Seriously. to chill. Yeah. Or like I'll try and do everything at once. I'm like, wow, if I'm not doing everything at once right now, I'm failing. Yeah, and it's easy to think that's what everyone is doing because you see it on social media. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't like compare literally like a demo reel of like everyone's best moments to just yourself because you're with yourself all the time, bro. <laughs> yeah, mm. it's not like one IG. Mm -hmm. Like, literally. Literally. You can put whatever you want on your social media. My dick. No. Oh my gosh, it's wrong with time, baby. It's what? Oh yeah. <laughs> Stella's been like, I am the wrong with this Dude, whole time. seriously. <laughs> I don't know why, because I was not excited about it. It's like, um, this is literally the best thing I've ever had. You love? Mm hmm. <laughs> Switcheroo. There's a book I read where it was talking about how you know how good a friend's or how comfortable someone is with another person. Based on like if they're if they're willing to just kind of like share their food. Oh yeah. Like, just kind of like because if you're not comfortable with someone and they just reach over and grab your food, it's, it's like, like get yeah. away. <laughs> yeah. Mm. This is Thai's tea boba, and this was actually the first time that I've had boba since going vegan. Do you love? Mm -hmm. I hate like mine with without. It's kind of sweet for me, so I don't. Want so if you want some, like, go ahead. Like, I don't know, it's like too sweet. Dude, that's crazy. Like, I drink plain cold brew. So my palate's a little thin. I think like, no, I'm just such a sweet person. Yeah. But I feel like your family like really fed you super healthy growing up, which is good. My family, I mean, fed me healthy, but also like fed me so many cookies. And so here I am. <laughs> yeah. So I just kind of grew up. Like I love it. I feel like I'm not eating all this broccoli. Mm. Just because I'm like, oh my love. Yeah. My mom tried to get me into broccoli. Like, she would literally cook vegetables so well. Probably now I would love them. But as a kid, I was like, ew. Mm. Yeah. She would make them super, like, Asian. Very so good. Wow. Mm. So this is like a fake meat and a tofu? I think so. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I was eating some field rice earlier today. Mm -hmm. Dude, I got um, field rush from milk and eggs, and like sometimes if I'm really lazy, I'll just eat just one of the sausages. Just whole. Oh, same. I ate two. Love it. So we asked you guys on IG to give us a few topics. Um, ooh, getting ghosted. Oh my god, we love. <laughs> I think you just have to understand that it's not your fault, you know? Yeah, like. Bitch. You're popping. Yeah, beautiful, thick, amazing. Sometimes it's just like the other person's going through shit. I'm really going through a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Have you ever that? Excuse me. And even though it is upsetting in the moment, you wouldn't want to be with someone who's gonna just like leave you like that, you know? So it's like the trash literally took itself out. Yeah, gone. Like goodbye. Dude. Yeah. Dude, this is so good. And I think just like not oh my god, right? Not like checking on their social media. Oh yeah. Like don't keep that hope. That's hard. Because they've already like I haven't tried the booth yet. Oh, you'll love. Mm. I'm very guilty of that. Hmm. Checking the social media. No, like no no no. Cause you wanna like cut them out. And you don't want to be reminded of what they're doing currently. Like, I've been on the, not on the opposite side, because I don't, I don't ghost people. Oh, yeah. If I want to hang out with someone, I'll just be like, 
Yo. I'm busy. I'm not you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, I'll literally just say that. Because I would appreciate if people were like that with me. So I'm like, okay, I know. Now I don't have to waste my time. Now you're not like, yeah, because if someone doesn't say anything, you're like, am I not pretty enough? Yeah. Like, oh my god, that one time I felt kind of uncomfortable yeah. saying something. Like, that yeah or like oh my god i made kind of a weird joke like on our second date like did they think that was weird but no it's literally it's not like it's not you it's just like it's like y'all are okay. they have obviously some issues <laughs> who does that bro <laughs> but yeah it's very immature Oops. to ghost also like yeah i don't know unless someone is like physically emotionally endangering you and you just need to like block them. Just block them. Like if someone's being a little too aggressive, you gotta be a little. A little block. A little block. A little fire, bitch. <laughs> Dude, this is so good. And the broth is so good. Oh, Look through my chest. A lot of these questions are like really funny. What? I like read through our conversation. I'm like, <laughs> oh, really? Um. Someone just says. Veggie girl. Someone said moving to LA really young. Um, it just, I don't know. It just felt like the thing that I had to do. Well, also like, I didn't feel like so young, but looking back I'm like, yeah. I was a baby, bro. Cause it's like, bro, that's the oldest I've ever been. Yeah, so you're like, what? Yeah, like yeah. even now when people are like, oh, you're, you're only 20. I'm like, what? Oh, but it's, looking back, I'm gonna be like, I didn't know anything. Mm -hmm. Or even like last year. Mm -hmm. Like even when you, like, all we have so many lol story times from when we were roommates, and they were roommates. <laughs> <laughs> but like, that if we just had a little bit more knowledge, we wouldn't have probably gone through that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or like, even if I had just waited literally one month moved to LA, I could have just moved to your apartment. Avoided all that tea. Mm hmm. Can I try the noodles? Oh my god, yeah. Oh no. These are mine. <laughs> I think, like, my dad also understands because he, he went to China when he was probably like 19, which is like to study abroad. This is so good. Dude, I know. It's like oily, but. It still up is quaking. <laughs> I can't be like so extra because we're like in public, but just no, y'all. I would usually be more extra. I'm polite. Yeah, this is like so good. Mm. I feel like obese, but in a good way. <laughs> I feel like this is going to my ass. <laughs> I know, dude. Obviously. Dude, your ass looks so good. Thank you. Oh my god, can we talk about our, our slim thick journeys and like oh yeah. Just like how do you feel? I feel good, but like it's skin too. Oh god, thank you. Like we see the changes in each other. Like I see obviously your ass getting fatter, like you know, like your abs, like damn like oh bitch. And like Stella sees me losing weight, but like I don't see it in myself. I don't think you see it in I yourself. I don't see it at all. So literally I'll be like what? Yeah, because it's like I literally, no matter how much weight I lose, I feel like huge. And I think I look like how I did when I was like 14. Dude, like that's crazy. You really don't. Like, that's crazy. Or I'll just be like, I don't know, because it's just like, especially when we put ourselves online, I get so many. Okay, especially since we started live streaming. Fuck, dude, yeah. Because <laughs> um, we live stream on this app called Vigo, and they, they feature us like on the main part of the page usually, which if you're featured on anything, like if you have a YouTube video that gets featured a lot, recommended to people, if you're featured live stream, you could just attract so many trolls. Yeah, because it's not like your subscribers watching. It's yeah, like yeah. It's people that just like don't know you, so they're just like making a judgment. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's always like, I get so many comments about my weight, and I'm like, what? But like, it's like, I don't see that at all, truly. But yeah, it's also funny that we're like, it's kind of like our opposite journey. Yeah. It's like your goal is to like gain weight, yeah. like muscle, but you know. Gain ass. I'm trying to like lose 
way. Yeah. Tone like, up like a little, but not like anything crazy. Like, oh my god, Sonia, like, wish you could just put my your ass in mine. Babe. I'm literally only eating a bra. <laughs> it's perfect because I always eat. Matt was talking about this with me. He was like, every time like I eat ramen, there's like no broth with so many noodles. Okay. When you eat it, it's opposite. And I was like, what can I say? Oh, we're just a match made in strength. Dude, I'm so thankful for my OG bros, you know? Seriously, do you want this last pork one? No. Dude, I haven't eaten. You literally have eaten all the broccoli. I have not eaten so one broccoli. Good. It's just like. If I eat vegetables at home, I usually just like make a microwave steam bag because mm. I get like lazy. Uh -huh. So when it's like sauteed and stuff, the sauce it's like so good. Dude, yeah. This one is my favorite. The I thought the beef and chicken were gonna be the same, just a different flavor, but it's really different texture. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's like how Guardian, they're literally like, hey, beef and chicken. Mm-hmm. Oh, mm. oh, thanks, babe. This kind of has like an eggy flavor, but it's like yeah, not that's egg. What I don't like. You don't like? I love it. Ladies, 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 ladies. ladies. Okay, what's another? Oh yes. Where's the tea? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Um. How to get through struggles in your friendship? Ooh. Ooh. I think it's important to know when something is just kind of like a bump in the road and when something is like a red flag stop sign like bro this is not yeah because yeah mm. sometimes it's like okay you know this is my good pal this is we need to work this out we just need to talk through this but sometimes something will happen and it's like i mean i guess you could work it out but it's like it's like like if someone steals from you Lies to you, yeah. especially lies to you like a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I think seeing the same thing over and over, but I feel like a lot of times I had breakthroughs then because they kept doing the same thing over and over. Yeah. And it was like, okay, you're my friend, this is fine, and then it's like not fine. Yeah. And then it's not. For for me, like I want to see the good in everyone. And you like yell at me sometimes <laughs> for this. Oh my god. Because <laughs> yeah. like someone that like is just like totally like. But, well, if someone has fucked you over, I'm like so angry. We'll never talk to them. Like, like I'll forgive them, them and you like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm like so angry. But if someone fucks me over, I'm like, oh my god, it's fine. Like, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Like, I just misunderstood. You're just going through a lot. <laughs> but yeah, seriously. Cross like some dough, also. I'm like kind of full, but I kind of want some cake. So I'm kind of gonna like. Yeah, show. obviously. Yeah. I guess how to get through struggles? I think just like. Um, being communicative mm -hmm. and like having compassion for your friend but also setting your own personal boundaries. Yeah, like don't let yourself be freaking welcome back to bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but then don't be like, I don't know. Be compassionate. I feel like we're, we like respect each other. You know, yeah, we're both very respectful. Respect on hustle. The grind. Like if Sonia's like, I never I have stuff to do today, I'm like, yes, queen. <laughs> hey guys, this is my mukbang. Oh, Sonjo else. <laughs> um, can we feed them to each other? Babe, it's our wedding cake. Sonia's gonna be married to you guys. I know. I got a proposal. Forgot to vlog it though. Did you vlog it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, I love the little squigglies. Wait, can we show like mm, guys? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this one is the vegan coconut cake. It this is from is a to meat meat carrot cake. <laughs> wow. Uh, orange chicken. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, this is just a regular carrot cake. Ready, Shlink? Yes. Thank you. Persian rug. Persian rug. Mm. Dude. Okay, I wanna try. Go. Wait, wait, I gotta feed. I gotta feed. You're feeding me? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> babe. Okay. Oh, babe. Mm. Or she comes back for more. 
Why does it have like no flavor? I like this. Well, probably because that one was sweeter. So we try this um, one. Yeah, I love like that one more. I like this one more too. I knew it. Taste dust. Okay. <laughs> you want some? Oh yeah. Persian. Too sweet for me. What? That is not even sweet at all. I'm like, what, dude? <laughs> oh, it is a little bit. But like a little bit. <laughs> Which when they put three pumps in my venti, I see. And I was like, oh, it's kind of hot. Love that. This is good though, not too sweet. I love this one. Terry could feel a love her. I just love the frosting. Dude, the frosting on this one is good. We are getting lit to parties. Literally me. Which one is your favorite of the cake? They're both pretty good. How did it feel like we do that? <laughs> Um, we're just, you know, children. I don't know, they're both pretty good. This is kind of more fall vibes. I like the little squigglies to go. Bitch. <laughs> Dude, the kid I'm babysitting, like, I made him a smoothie yesterday, and for the first two sips, he was like, wow, this is so good. And I was like, thank you. And he literally was like, we should open up a smoothie bar. And I was like, true, thank you. And then he did like one more sip, and he was like, actually, it's really bad. What is the truth? <laughs> Was he joking? No, like kids, like kids that young don't really understand like sarcasm, you know? I think maybe just liked it at first and I didn't like it anymore. New alcohol. Because I was making myself a smoothie, and so he was like, "Oh my god, I want a smoothie so bad." And I was like, "Okay, like I'm not, I'm not gonna make you a smoothie, you know?" And he just like, "Oh <laughs> Fuck. But you know, it's all good. It's fine. <laughs> Do you have any last minute tea to spill? I saw Sonia. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you? Honestly, I don't. I feel like life has been like good. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling like I have a good squad of friends. Good bros. Yeah, good bros. Good like, money. It's <laughs> A lot going on. Like, I feel like. Even, uh, cause last time I hung out with you was Monday and it's Friday. Usually we hang out like literally every single day, but I just been so busy. I didn't even like realize that it was, I just thought we hadn't hung out in like two days. That's crazy. It really does not feel like that long. Wow. It was like, every day I've just been like, it's not like we don't talk. No. Like, <laughs> bitch. It's like, um, sorry, I don't like texting. I'm just a bad texter. When people say that, it's like cringe. I mean, it's like, same, but like I'm not bad to my dad, I'm not bad to you, I'm not bad to someone I have a crush on. So if you're not like, immediate family, a bay, a bay, or like, my BFF, a money, whatever. Uh, money whatever, babe, you should have. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm a bad texter, cause I'm not invested, bro. It's like, <laughs> yeah. For sure. Mm -mm, mm -mm. But sometimes I am a mess, really, actually. <laughs> I'm just a frosting boot. I would just need to do a quick diagram of the difference between these two. Okay, but you ate part of this one too. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Why is it at that angle? It's like. <laughs> this is like um, when you're driving down like I 5 and you get to like the farm part. <laughs> And this is when you're driving down I-5 and it's like, you're just leaving Bellingham. And it's like the scary rock walls. And it's like, if there's an earthquake, all this is like down. little... Yeah. <laughs> and then a random... And there's like a net on the rocks. And you're like, bro. You're like, is, is that where you're walking? Is it where you're Dude, one time I got stuck on I-5 going back from Seattle because a rock had fallen on the road. It blocked off like the whole lane. They're like, caution, rocks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, by the time I'm like, that's a concern, she did. <laughs> Literally. Dude, speaking of cars, Bjorn, 
You finna get a new one? No, yeah. Dude, mm -hmm. gave him my first car. That was emotional. I'm really surprised now that the car is gone. I can finally say it. I'm really surprised I didn't total it. <laughs> and not even that I'm an unsafe driver, because you know how safe I am. But like, sometimes that was like dangerous. Like I'd be too cautious that I would like almost die, you know? Yeah. It's like the complete opposite of every bro we know. <laughs> not every bro. Dude, when bros drive scary, I scream. Me I mean, too. Stop. Yeah. Like I will. <laughs> the other day we were like hanging out with some bros and there was one guy who brought his own car and he was about to go in his car alone. So I was like, oh, like I'll ride with you. I was like, bye. <laughs> like, I don't want you to be alone. Like that's lame. And so they started like, there were two cars. They started like racing each other and I was screaming, like full on screaming. Literally as I was screaming at them, I, you guys passed and I saw you screaming at him and I was like, see, we don't like it. So I was literally like, stop, stop. <laughs> Because you know that bros will just ruin their lives. Well, you can ruin yours, but you're not going to ruin mine, sweetie. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Bye so bye. anyways, you guys. No, you're going to film the actual outro. <laughs> well, I've been like, oh, I guess. <laughs> Dude, honestly, she is really inspiring. Like, I want to be her. Dude, she is... She has so many subscribers and she is getting those brand deals. Like you know they're paying her like twenty thousand dollars, fifteen, like ten. And she's fucking what? Fourteen? Like I'm proud. American Girl Tiffany is honestly kinda quaking. Dude, and she oh my gosh, I like understand, but I she talks about how her mom will like buy her stuff for her ASMR videos and like helps her film. I'm like it's just so cute. She was doing like the honeycomb one, she's like, my mom bought me. Yeah. Her. Yeah. Bitch. <laughs> or like she was filming the um sassy police officer role play. I didn't see that. <laughs> oh. Shook didn't make a video on it yet. <laughs> but like I just realized I I don't know. Yeah. I, I was like the whole <laughs> Oh but she was talking about how her mom was like filming that. Really? Yeah. Oh, and no, they so couldn't stop laughing. Awesome. And I was like, bruh, that's so cute. Wow. <laughs> My daughter. <laughs> So anyways, you guys, that is the mukbang. Be sure to check out Walk and Roll Long Beach. I will link their Instagram down below. Give them a follow. Comment thick on all of their posts because why the fuck not? Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a like. If you dislike it, give it a dislike. Give Stella a subscribe. Thank you for being in my video. <laughs> Coming all the way to Long Beach with me. Sure, shall we say? Uh, be sure to follow us on Instagram, Vigo. We have both been streaming. Sometimes we PK. We're a bit wild on the app, so uh, beware. For beware. Um, but yeah, love y'all so much, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.